Sundance is kind of like the top of the mountain for indie filmmakers. I just think everybody just dreams of getting the Sundance someday and it's very exciting when you get that call or that email that says, you know, we want to have you. I'm Patrick Lawrence and I'm the editor of Clara's Ghost. Clara's Ghost is a mix of horror film, family drama, and comedy that takes place in a house in a small town in Connecticut and it's centered around the Reynolds family. I ended up editing on set in the house that we were shooting and I would ingest the film, transcode it, and then begin cutting. And usually I was anywhere from like six hours to a day behind camera, depending on how big of the scenes we were doing each day. But because of that, I was able to pinpoint things that maybe were out of place, shots that were missed, things that weren't connecting properly, and I could run downstairs and alert the DP or Brady Elliott, the director, and let them know that, hey, we're kind of missing this thing. So at any time if something was missed, we could replace it. I chose Premiere Pro simply because it's so easy for me. Uh, it's, it's become just a part of my workflow and I'm so fast with it. I have a process that involves a lot of syncing and transcoding, but then I could just throw any random footage in and because it works natively with so many different types of footage, I can just cut and go and get my dailies together, get my scenes together and show how things are working. In terms of Creative Cloud, uh, my workflow consistently involves Premiere and After Effects and Photoshop. And I almost have all open at all times because I'm just jumping back and forth between all of them. Because we had so many phone inserts, we had another sequence where the Sweet Sisters are riding on, on a train and they get noticed by another guy that's sitting on the train and he's taking photos of them. And so I had to throw together in Photoshop a elongated Instagram feed and then sent that to our animator, who then used it in After Effects to create you know, the animation of her scrolling up. What I love about editing is it allows me to be a part of the creation process. I'm able to sit down and work with a director who have these brilliant ideas and these brilliant stories, and you just need to kind of help them shape it together. 